Hey friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Mandy the Handmade Homeschooler and today we're going to talk about one of my favorite things which is curriculum and we are specifically going to talk about history and even more specifically my favorite history curriculum. I feel like history is one of those things that I couldn't get right for quite a few years in our homeschooling journey. I have tried everything, everything from Abeka to my father's world to BJU to, um, I even tried the good and the beautiful once before I was more familiar with their company, like when they were brand new. So obviously I have become more knowledgeable about history curriculum and what I'm looking for over the years. I've been able to narrow it down and kind of tailor to our needs a little bit more, but it took me a long time to get there. <laughs> now I have two that I really enjoy and I feel like I can say this with like certainty just because I have tried everything to nail down the one that I want. I have changed curriculum mid-year. I mean, it's I even have a video of just like so many different history curriculum and kind of just like comparing them. It's on my channel if you just search for history curriculum. I have so many of them. But I found two that I just really enjoy and that I kind of want to put in a video for you as like my favorite companies for history just because it's that time of year where everybody's buying right now and I thought it might be a helpful video for you. So the first one that I want to talk about is Knotgrass. I really do enjoy Knotgrass books. I like their style. I like the way that the books are written. And honestly, my kids just really enjoy the books. And this kind of fits into more of a Charlotte Mason style. And without being like too Charlotte Mason, without the... the I feel like it's gentle without being too gentle, if you know what I mean. Like, I have found some Charlotte Mason stuff, especially for, you know, middle school and lower, the lessons sometimes can get so short that my kids are kind of like, that's it. Like, they want more. You know what I mean? Like, my kids feel like they want more out of a lesson. So, I like that about Knotgrass. Knotgrass has a little bit more meat to it without being overwhelming and it's more of like a I can take it at my own pace type of book. So my son requested this last year Knotgrass's America the Beautiful. Now I really think this is a two-year course. You can go however long you want with it. I have a whole video dedicated to just this specific curriculum. You can look it up on my channel. I love the pictures in here and one of the things that I love about Knotgrass is they add in nature and animals to their books. My son is an animal kid. He loves that type of stuff and he loves the part of the lessons where they talk about animals within the region. He gets so excited for those pages. And it comes with all kinds of different things too. Like you're going to get not just that but you get like a company books. And you can add on your literature packages too. So there's like everything from the timelines to maps to um, actual workbooks and lessons. And then you actually get like, like solid books like this. There are two major textbooks plus this one that come in just the basic package. And each of those bigger textbooks has 75 lessons in it. So I feel like this could easily be a two year curriculum. But I really enjoy that one. I like, I like their style. They are a Christian company, and they turn everything back to scripture, which I think is a you know one of the most important things for us when we're looking for curriculum for our children. The next company is going to be no surprise to any of you, but my top history company is going to be Generations. I think Bible and history is where Generations is the strongest, and they have such a wide variety of history books. I love that about them. One of the ones that I love the most is kind of their elementary through um, some of middle school where they are doing the Taking the Nations for Jesus. And it's a series of books, like this one is Africa, this one is Europe, 
they have America, they have like, they have all the continents, I think, you know, they have Asia and Europe and Africa, they have America, they, they have so many different ones. And you do one, like one country or continent per year. And I think you don't even have to do them in order too. So that's really neat. Their books, depending on the, the level usually means grade. And this one's level five, this one is level six. There's a big difference between level five and level six, I'll tell you that much. But the inside is all color pages, which I love about their books. It's very colorful, it's very engaging. There's wonderful pictures and photography. And that is one thing I've always said about Generations is Generations has some of the best photography in their textbooks that I have ever seen. Now, when your kids get to high school, they get these bigger books. Like this one is Preparing the World for Jesus. And there is another one on my shelf that also goes with this. And like, the, it's the same thing. You know, you have beautiful photography and pictures. And this is like their world history type of curriculum. They have another one, which is a huge book that I have over there. It is so big it's it can be a two-year curriculum and that one is the um the american history one i love that american history textbook it's actually one of my very favorite textbooks out of all of the ones i have ever had is that american history textbook my oldest child went through that in 10th grade for his american history credit and we really enjoyed that as a family just as a family going through that one that one was um we learned so much like i learned so much going back through that book much more than i want to say i learned in my public school american history class that one is the most informative american history course i have ever seen everything in their books has always been 100 percent solid and i so appreciate that as somebody who you know loves scripture loves god's word and puts a high value on being scripturally accurate so i so enjoy that from um from generations and the other thing that i really enjoy is that generations makes everything so affordable like these books, I got them all like half off during one of their sales. So, so affordable. Now, Knockgrass on the other hand, I love Knockgrass, don't get me wrong. And I bought this brand new. I, I paid a pretty penny for that. It's an investment. This one, Generations, makes everything so affordable for me as a military family. It just, you know, that's really important to us is that I can, you know, I can save a few dollars. So I really enjoy that they do that. They have sales constantly. If you need to know about my about the sales, I have a link down in my description where you can sign up for my email list. I put out an email every time that Generations has a sale because their curriculum when it goes on sale is the, the prices are just phenomenal. So I I purchase everything on sale from Generations on purpose. Like I wait for the sales and then I purchase other thing that I like about both of these companies is that they are open and go. I really don't have to think about anything. I just kind of open the lesson and there it is. And then uh, Generations even has a in their teacher book like an outlined um, schedule of everything that you need to do for each lesson, which makes my life so much easier. I don't have to think about it. You know, I'm someone who has, I have lupus. I have, you know, pretty serious chronic illness and there are just days where like my brain cannot even process information very well. So for me to be able to kind of open and go with that curriculum is essential. Like I, I need something like that, especially as you know, things progress with me, you know, and if I have a bad day, it just makes my life so much easier to know that my kids can easily follow along. I can easily follow along. So my kids are able to follow along and do all of this work independently and not have to worry about waiting for me or anything like that. I mean, I love that. I can be a manager of, of this curriculum if I want to, rather than the main teacher. However, I like to actually teach this curriculum, so I try to do my best with that as well. So those are my two absolute favorites. And, you know, there's an honorable mention. I also really like Compass Classroom. We've been going through that one this year with my oldest. He's been doing the uh, modernity class. That one is a great one too. I will 
leave a link for that as well. Like those are, those are great classes. I really enjoy Compass Classroom's videos. They're so engaging. It's like watching a TV show. It's almost like, like watching the History Channel if the History Channel was Christian. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way that I can describe it. Like if, if, if the History Channel was a Christian network, like it would be like watching something like really engaging from the History Channel. And you know, everything is done online with that. I know not everybody likes the online options when it comes to curriculum. I don't mind it just because I know it's kind of preparing him for college. You know, my kids are gonna be doing a lot of probably online college, which is fine. And I want them to have the knowledge and understanding and the practice of using online courses. And Compass Classroom, I think, does a great job of that. But without making it boring, it's not like you're just staring at a computer screen every day. So, you know, they add in all kinds of cool projects and, th and things like that, even like uh, portfolios, art projects, things like that. They're all added into this online program. So it's not just computer work all day, every day. So really cool stuff. I really enjoy those three companies. I would love to know down in the comments, what is your favorite curriculum for history? Let me know. I'm always looking at new stuff and I haven't actually purchased everything this year. So I would love to know what your favorite is and maybe I will take a look at that when I see something new that I might wanna check out whatever you guys are using. So let me know down in the comments. I will see you in the next video. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and happy homeschooling.